So just so that everybody is ask, who's asking about the angel policy, I just wanted to explain that to you. So with Disney, it's not about us selling our cards. This is about actually crafting. So just to make that angel policy clear, it's not about selling cards. That's not something we can do with a Disney fan, with our Disney license, but it is about crafting. We've updated our angel policy on there as well, so you can see that. And we've put that in writing, rather than me voicing it, because I may get that wrong, but you've got it absolutely clear in black and white. And then, and that's actually on the Facebook page. We'll put it on the website tomorrow, but it's on the Facebook Well, let me just tell you what the official line is right here, right now. The official Crate and Craft policy on Disney is this. The Disney range of products from Crate and Craft are covered by a legal agreement with Disney authorised licensee, Character World. Now, with this agreement in place, we have been assured that our customers as, as individuals are free to be creative with the Disney approved products, creating finished products to gift or sell. A great deal of effort has gone into ensuring that our products comply with the Disney copyrights, our dyes and Disney approved designs manufactured to the highest standards. Using these products will produce finished craft items that are genuine representations of the characters and Disney brands. These products have been thoroughly audited by the Disney Corporation over several months. Please enjoy the products and be confident that the finished craft projects that you create will be true representations of the Disney brand. So there you go. If I stood here without a license, right, and I put that shape, just that shape on the telly, it closes down. Because you're not allowed. That's, and I'm not saying that in a bad way, it's a positive way. That's how Absolutely. protected this brand is. That's how wonderful uh, that this image is because they've protected it. And we've got him and he's official and he's all above board and everything. I think this is going to be one of the most important crafting purchases you ever make. And we should just explain the angel policy to you. So uh, let's put it in writing so you know exactly where we stand. First of all, the Disney range of products from Create and Craft are covered by a legal agreement with a Disney authorised licensee, Character World. With this agreement in place, we've been assured that our customers, that's you, as individuals are free to be creative with the Disney approved products, creating finished products to gift or sell. A great deal of effort has gone into ensuring that our products comply with Disney copyrights. Our dyes are Disney approved designs manufactured to the highest standards. Using these products will produce finished craft items that are genuine representations of the characters and Disney brand. These products have been thoroughly audited by the Disney Corporation over several months. 
Please enjoy the products and be confident that the finished craft projects that you create will be true representations of the Disney brand. Now, obviously we are dealing with a company um, and indeed a brand that is highly prized and also highly protected. So what does this mean for you if you're wanting to make and sell? Well, just to make sure that there is absolutely no confusion, here is the official statement that has come from Crate and Craft as we are the official retailers and also Disney themselves. So, the Disney range of products from Crate and Craft are covered by legal agreement with the Disney authorised licensee, Character World. With this agreement in place, we've been assured that our customers as individuals are free to be creative with the Disney approved products, creating finished products to gift or sell. But what I would like to do is talk about the angel policy. Because a lot of people, quite rightly, when they're spending this kind of money, they're wondering whether or not they are able to make to sell, whether for charity or indeed for themselves. Now, obviously, a lot of you will be aware that we are dealing with highly protected copyrighted material. So what Crate and Craft have done, they have negotiated with Disney the following. This is a policy that comes from Disney and also us here at Crate and Craft as the official retailer. I think what's been great as well is the angel policy. Because oh, I think that was it. something that you know, a lot of people are quite really concerned about, mm -hmm. but I think it's awesome. Oh, it's incredible. It's, it's just, you know, I, I could never even dream that we will be able to make and sell our products, our finished products, which is just so generous. Um, and yeah, and it's been a, you know, a configuration between Coz and Character World and Disney. And then, yeah, the other day so we got there. We did, my Got the yes, you oh, can. So, I remember the angel policy, whether you're making for friends and family or whether or not you are selling, you can do that now. No problem whatsoever. Now, I think the word about the angel policy is spreading because that is proving very, very popular this evening. Mm -hmm. So um, we'll go through the angel policy once again because I think it's important. Because I know if you're spending that kind of money, more than likely you want to recoup some of your costs somehow. Absolutely. Yes? So there's the details, but we're going to show you the angel policy and I'll read it out as well just so that everyone is in the clear. Okay. So the Disney range of products on Create and Craft are covered by a legal agreement with the Disney authorised licensee character work. With this agreement in place, we have been assured that our customers as individuals are free to be creative with the Disney approved products, creating finished products to gift or sell. A great deal of effort has gone into ensuring that our products comply with Disney copyrights. Our dyes are Disney approved designs manufactured to the highest standards. Using these products will produce finished craft items. They are genuine representations of the characters and Disney brand. These products have been thoroughly audited by Disney Corporation over several months. Please enjoy the products and be confident that the finished craft products, projects that you create will be true representations of the Disney brand. I'd just like to add my own personal thing about this, adding in my experience of almost 15 years in terms of, um, of presenting on shopping television. Interesting to note that whenever you see anything on television, there are certain uh, agencies that are there to ensure that what you hear is the truth, like the ASA. doesn't exist on the internet. doesn't exist. You can say what you like on the internet. doesn't exist. So just to highlight that point that we cannot stand here and say these things unless they are 100% true. Absolutely. On the internet, you can say what you like. I just thought I'd mention that.
So I make cards for myself and my family, but I make cards for charity and I make cards uh, to sell. And I've been doing it for ages and ages. What is the deal when it comes to Disney? Well, if you go to creativecraft.tv, our website, every single product will have the angel policy attached to it and it'll talk you through uh, the ability to make your cards, sell your cards for charity and selling them, etc, etc, etc. You might be thinking, oh, how can I use these things? Of course, that's called an angel policy. We have a very generous angel policy available. You can see all the details about that angel policy on our website, uh, which, of course, is createandcraft.tv. It's there and it's under each and every product that you buy. The angel policy is there for you. For me, I would want to keep them the, the correct colours because that's what makes it Disney. Disney, exactly. And I think, you know, they get it so right that we really don't need to change that. It's just but isn't fabulous. that amazing as well, though, Mel? They've allowed, obviously, when you are oh, doing paper incredible. crafting, you can do anything with it. So it's amazing that they've allowed us to use this because you would have said, I mean, they couldn't ever license they couldn't ever um what's the word uh make sure that this happened uh they could have said no you can only people can only use these dyes if they're going to use the reds and whites they can't well it has to, that no it has to be a true replication of the disney brand yeah. which is mickey mouse with his ears and his yeah. red shorts yeah. and all the rest of it so keep it as close as you can but yeah just incredible that we can actually use these on our projects and make them sell them Of course, we are the only retailer that are using Disney in the crafting world. So that is absolutely incredible. Make it a fridge magnet. Make that out and put it on and, and embroider it onto T-shirts and do your own frozen T-shirts. Um, do you know, it's only just over a week since we launched this on the channel. And although it was months in the sort of the bringing together, the designing, working with the different companies that were involved. We actually did it in a very, very short amount of time. Yeah, so normally, we're incredibly proud of now, this. Now, how long does it normally take for, for a company to get in, if we get involved with Disney, to get this sort of thing together? Well, Is from that... a standing start, probably about 18 months, I would think. But wow. what we've done, we've literally done this since the beginning of the year. And... I don't know whether or not you um, have heard that Create and Craft have been working over the last 18 months, really, to bring you an incredibly popular license. Welcome to Craft Live. I'm Stephanie Waitman, this is Mel Heaton, Hello. and this is Disney. We can't wait to share with you this hour. Now then, if you have any questions about our angel policy, which has been developed and endorsed by our local trading standards office, just go to our website and click our angel policy and it will all be uh, sorted out online there.
Uh, we often get asked about the angel policy. It's quite simple. Go and have a look on the website. Disney have given us a, a very um, generous angel policy. You can find all that about that on the, uh, the website. Once you do that, Mel, then um, if you've got any questions about our angel policy, it's been developed and endorsed by our local trading standards office. So just go to our website and check out our angel policy there.